Hello everybody and welcome to my Wolfenstein The Old Blood Chapter 7 Old Town Collectibles Guide. I think I say, I think I say that in a different order almost every video. But anyway, in this video I will be showing you where to find all of the one letter, all eight gold bars, and the nightmare level, and for those who wish to have the secret character art, eh, it's not really a secret, uh, all of the silver within the the nightmare level so very first gold bar when you're here on the map it's right at the beginning uh you're supposed to lower this by shooting the ropes uh before or after you do it does not matter uh come over to this little dock here and hop in the water and just underneath it will be your gold bars for your next gold bar when you're here on the map just a little bit ahead once you bust through the next door uh there'll be a fight going on here uh, either deal with it or ignore them, but either way, uh, come back here and take a leap across that gap there. You'll find some armor and a bunch of crates, and within one of the crates will be your gold bars. For your next gold bar, when you're at this point on the map, once again, just a little bit further ahead. This is a very short level, so all these are pretty condensed. Uh, when you come to this plaza here, uh, there'll be a bunch of zombies. Uh, once again, you don't have to worry about dealing with them if you don't want to, but either way, hop out of your little mech there again and jump over here on your right to this lower area to see a stockpile of ammo and your gold bars. For the nightmare level, from that gold that you just collected, jump down into the water. And now to go back to the beginning of the level, you go through that tunnel. But if you swim through this tunnel here, it's a pretty hefty swim, considering how uh, crap of a swimmer BJ is. But anyway, at the end of this tunnel here, you will find a secret area that has some 75 armor uh, vest there. A bunch of crates, health, ammo, couple letters but the important thing is a dirty old mattress to have a little kip on now for anybody who wants to find all the silver pieces within the level continue watching for those who don't care about unlocking the concept art that you get for doing it go to the time stamp stamp that is on the screen now and it will take you back to the regular level and its collectibles for your first 11 pieces of silver make it to this point here on the map There'll be one guy in this room, and when you open up this door, there will be two lieutenants. Uh, and spread across the room. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven pieces of silver. Uh, just like in the last uh, level, there is only two places with silver. Uh, so it should be a fast one. As a side note, this is where the key is that you will need to exit the nightmare. Okay, so for your next and final five pieces of silver, make it to this point here on the map. Uh, and enter this empty room here. There isn't a lot of enemies along this way. Uh, but anyway, go to the back wall. You can open it up. And it will take you to here, which also looks empty. But go to that wall, you can open it up, push it back. Oh, look at that, another empty room. But just wait, go around the corner, open that up, and another empty room. You can see where this is going. Uh, open this up, another empty room. Open this up, another empty room go over here oh what that one doesn't open no it's because this one opens this time oh look at that what do you know it is still empty will this open no but you know what will that one it's ridiculous i'm not gonna lie it is a series of just empty empty secret walls that you have to push and finally in the end you'll have your five silver and a health pack that's worth 80 if you need it for those of you following along this is where the exit to the nightmare is as you can see it's a fairly straightforward path with very little backtracking but there is a fairly large portion of this that you do not have to go to if you do not wish to 
But either way, once you've made it here with all 16 pieces of silver, you will then unlock the Nightmare White Guard character art. For your next gold bar, just a little bit further ahead in that plaza, uh, your objective is in this building there. Ignore the flame that's following me. Apparently a zombie bugged out. Um, but anyway, go to your left. You'll see the Bootschaus building, whatever the hell that means. But on this little lip here, at the end of it will be your gold. For your next piece of gold, uh, still in the same plaza, right where you got your last one at the end of this path here, go into the Bootschaus house and head up the stairs and in the cabinet on the right next to the window will be your goal. For the letter in this level, uh, right here on the map, right at your objective on this table to the left, I accidentally picked it up during the let's play, but it is right here on the table next to some guns and ammo. For your next piece of gold, exactly where we were before, there's your objective, turn around and look through this window and you will see the gold stain on a box right outside. For your next gold bar, when you reach this point here on the map, you'll need to find a key to open that gate there. If you go into the house where your key is sit on the table and go just into the back, behind a beam will be your gold. For your final piece of gold, once you make it to this point on the map, you'll be running through this area with a whole lot of zombies and once you've made it up to the other end from where you started on the alcove here on your right will be your final gold for this level and that has been all one letter all eight pieces of gold the nightmare level and all the silver within it for chapter seven old town thank you for watching and i hope this helped